All right, folks, you guessed it. We're going to be video inside the SRX2 Gen 3, the new Serpent car. It just dropped uh, Monday to the public, and we're going to go inside. All right, we have Serpent driver. JT. JT, and we're going to talk about his new Serpent kit. You just got it, what, Monday? Yeah, I got it Monday. I got it built on Wednesday. Finished okay. everything up with the electronics on Thursday. Okay, okay. Uh, kit springs? Kit springs, yeah. So uh, there'll be greens in the front and they're running blue Astro in the rear. Okay, okay. Uh, shock wheels and pistons? Um, so the pistons are uh, 2 by one6 in the front and 2 by one7 in the rear. Okay. And uh, there's 450 CST in the front and 300 in the rear. Okay. First off, what I like is they, it comes with aluminum shock caps. Yep. I mean, that's the first thing I, I noticed. I was like, man, okay. And then the turnbuckles. Uh, I haven't seen any turnbuckles like that. I mean, that's guaranteed not to pop off or break. No, will not break um, as far as pulling the stud out or anything. Yeah, yeah. The only issue I've been having, and I've been talking with Billy Easton about, uh -huh. is this issue right here. Right, where it's right. putting a lot, everything up here in, is, in the front has been strengthened. Uh -huh. So it's finding the weakest point, and if you kind of scrub a pipe really, really hard, uh -huh. it'll stretch that turnbuckle. Okay. That's the only issue I've had. Okay, okay. Um, get this up right here. Uh, pills. What pills are you running? Um, so in the rear, which I changed from stock, which is normally center, mm -hmm. uh, front and rear in the C and D blocks, uh -huh. I went for uh, one center uh -huh. up in the front uh -huh. C, and then all the way out bottom left one in the rear uh -huh. to give it more traction, more bite in this track. Okay. 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 And up front, it's still kit set up up front? Like Everything's the... kit set up in the front. Okay. I mean, I'm really liking the color. You can see the detail that they yeah. that they done. Uh, get the, spin the dog wings for CVDs. Uh, you can really see the detail in that. Mm -hmm. And then in the, in the out drives and the CVDs, there's actually three adjustments where you can actually have it longer or shorter. Oh, really? Yeah. So oh. you can make it just that little bit longer because there's steps to it. Right. In the actual hub, so. Okay, cool, cool. Gives it that more adjustment. Uh, how was kit set up? Kit I mean, set up was, I was not for this track. Right, got me um, running high grip. High grip, yeah. yeah. It's, it was more for a uh, dirt, sealed surface. I mean, right. that's what Billy Easton races on. Right, um, right. 10 scale. Right. I mean, it was decent, mm -hmm. but it, it needed more. Right. L little, little little adjustments, but other than that, I mean, I've been sticking with the stock setup. Like, you did the peel change, and that was, like, yeah. it just brought the, it alive. The one the one change in the C and D blocks, and it's just so much more grip. Okay, okay. Uh, fit and finish? Immaculate? Everything was good? Yeah. I mean, they're everything went together really well okay. um, there wasn't any issues that I saw okay. um, everything was pretty thought out and put together okay. really really well uh, we flip and see the bottom of the chassis if it... okay cool cool get the back here the wing oh I like that wing setup mm -hmm. And then there's also the adjustment because this is obviously a one stop shop for the, the two wheel now right. instead of having multiple options. Uh -huh. They actually have the posts where you can move them back and forth right here. Uh -huh. You can actually, if you flip the car over, they have the other adjustments and you uh -huh. can also run the LCG packs. Right. Yep. Cool. Oh. Thank you, thank you. Yep, no problem. Um, so the, the kit dropped Monday, so the public can buy it now, right? Yep, it'll okay. be bought now. All right. Um, any little things, any little tricks in the build that you done that you do only? No, I try to follow the book as much as I can. Okay. I mean, Billy Easton, I mean, can't go wrong with what he says. So. No, nah, he's a cool guy. Like, yeah. he's super cool. Like, I've been talking to him and everything, and 
Really, really helpful. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've seen him help everybody. You know. Hey, thank you. Yep. See you out on the track. Have a